Hello and welcome back to Snowtopia here on a Raw Slow Gaming where we take it raw, slow and nice. Uh, so this game is on, in Open Alpha, we are playing Open Alpha 4 or update 4 and we are continuing our uh, ski resort here and I'm uh, well the intro here on from a slightly different angle from uh, the bottom of the mountain looking at the peaks uh, rather than the other way around which we have uh, done uh, for uh, the last couple of episodes uh, so this is basically before Alpha, beta or early access or whatever you want to call it so you can see here quite easily like this chairlift going into the ground and uh, pretty much no real uh, detail with it. So just um, at the moment this is pretty much uh, proof of concept but I still think this game is pretty darn great actually just the way it is and uh, they are developing it slowly and steady i uh, don't know their exact plans for uh, release and uh, further development on the game and uh, and such but uh, i guess we will get to know that sooner or later from the developers so what is our next plan of attack? So last episode around we tackled this peak. Uh, we could tackle this peak or take it off down to our, uh, another village here. Uh, don't really want to do that just yet. Uh, what I kind of want to do is uh, extend this run so you could have it come down to here. And then you can have like a real gentle area and down here. Uh, so I think that is what we'll plan in here for uh, this episode to start with. And I think we will go with a chair lift from well for here. So I think we should end uh, the chair lift somewhere along the lines of there. And apparently we can go straight through uh, the houses, but that line actually looks decent. Uh, and this is a decent place to put it, yeah. Maybe a little bit off the map almost. And yeah, I don't really like that actually. So we're going to redo that. I do like the placement of this though. So let's see here. So I don't want to put it too much there. So we'll put it a little bit more in the middle there. Uh, and that looks actually pretty darn fine. Or pretty darn good, rather. So let's work on some gentle slopes here. Uh, going down from, uh, well, the lift pretty much. So let's see here, we'll do this really between the houses here. And white here is going upwards, but uh, the game doesn't complain about it too much. So that's good. So now this main one, we'll take the slow one first, I think. Uh, so the right hand side here is going to be a little bit more slope in it, I believe, uh, at least. So let's see here, how do we want to do this? We certainly don't want it to be more than a blue anywhere along the line here, really. Or line, the run. So we want it to be pretty sweeping and pretty darn green if we can have it as such. So we'll go up here a little bit. Uh, now this is, that is actually not too bad at all. It's a little bit too blue though. Don't really want that. And how are we going to do here? Now if this turns blue, I will be really sad no green steepness is four percent 700 meters long slope 
Yeah, that, that looks like um, quite the correct numbers, according to me. And actually, I think that looks really neat. Now, why are you workforce needed? All right, there you go. So one of our workforce on that lift. Uh, we only need three more skiers uh, for uh, another person in our workforce. So that's nice. Uh, so you could do some like super short lift there or runs. Don't really want to do that. Don't really like that. So we will not do that. Um, not super happy that I have to take the run off from the, this main run uh, for the one that is going to slope a little bit more. Slope is blocked by lift. So this is pretty much straightforward going down. Actually, I think uh, I think we'll start it up here a little bit earlier. Actually, actually, yes, so we can have it go up here on the mountain, so to say, a little bit more, and then tackle pretty much straight to. Let's go downhill. Why can't? Well, let's do like this then. Alright, so I want to connect. I can connect to there. And there we go. A blue run. Yeah, that looks pretty nice. And let's have a. Let's actually just have a medium one here. Now I kind of want to tackle this hump going pretty much straight over it. Uh, I guess that I might not be able to do that. Or apparently I can. So that's nice. Uh, no, not quite like that, but along those lines. So something like that, a small a red run. Yeah, that looks nice. And then I guess we should maybe have a cross run here between these two guys or a couple. Uh, I think we want to have like a cross run here. Slope must go downhill. All right, so how the hell is that run blue? And how does that even work? All right, that that one feels a little bit like a stupid run. Uh, that's all right, I'm actually quite happy with that. Would like to spur things up with like Maybe some trees and things like that though, but uh, I think that's all right. Now the question here, we will connect some slopes from uh, this area. That can get to be a little bit crazy for sure. So I'm thinking that have a run going down here. By rock, yeah, I know. Let's go down here. So, now that's, that's a pretty darn interesting slope. Yeah, I really like the shape of that slope actually. A little bit wonky there with the camera, sorry for that camera work guys. Yeah, really like that slope actually. Uh, so that's one part of it done. Uh, then I want to do like a long one from here as well. We'll actually do that medium, a little bit smaller. So we'll have that go somewhere along the lines of... Slope must go downhill. Now the question is, will we be able to get over this hump here? It doesn't really seem like that's the case. Maybe if we go a little bit, yeah. So now 
that is definitely a run that we want to do as well. Uh, we don't want that to freak out as much though. And so we'll do something along the lines of that. Can we? Yeah, we can. So like a super <laughs> run on uh, the edge of the world there pretty much. Still, I think that's pretty interesting for our run. And I think we will add in uh, a couple of uh, runs here in between. So for sure one connecting like that. And we will do a medium run from here. So... Scope is blocked by Cliff, all right. Let's not get in the way for Cliff. Come on, no. Yeah, that works. 22% slope, that's uh, quite a lot that. And we can get in or get away with one more. Oh, sorry for that camera work again. One more medium run here. Just straight down here. There we go, 23%. So. Got some really steep slopes coming off that and uh, down to this really flat area. So that's actually sort of funny, but uh, still. Quite pleased with that actually. Uh, let's put on the ski runs layer. So yeah, as uh, as we're continuing here, as I said, it's uh, the black runs, they are pretty darn easy to make. Green runs are pretty darn impossible to make. Blue ones and red ones can be hard as well to make what you want to do. Uh, but um, it's attainable at least, but like making green ones is super tricky overall. Uh, like this one. This one getting to blue, I, I don't understand why. This one I tried to have to blue and it is blue, but 7% steepness. I don't really think that is a blue rated slope um, by any means, if you really think about it, but uh, all right. Uh, what is unfortunate though, is that we don't got any more skiers here. Uh, we're still stuck here at 98. Uh, so let's actually speed up the game here and see if we can't get in to a hundred because we will need a hundred skiers to have any possibility to get uh, well more lifts in and without more lifts we can't really do too much more now the question is where should we take take it to the next level uh, oh we have prepared over here I see I see but we haven't no, we haven't hooked up any any personnel to that side and we prepared here with the crazy runs or runs Going from this and to from this as well, yeah, it all should work. Now, of course, we, as I said, we'll have a little bit of a trouble. Uh, and we have no skiers on in that lift. One percent on that lift. Zero percent. Zero and zero. So we have like little, literally no one in our uh, lifts. Um, that is uh, troubling, definitely. So where the heck are all our 97 skiers? 
Should we go and uh, have a look for them? Well, uh, I'm doing that no matter what you're saying. And uh, so far we aren't finding anyone. So let's... Uh, so we already got someone going on there then, I guess. So what, what do you guys think about this game? I know it's pretty well received, at least on uh, my channel. Like getting uh, pretty much most views on any content I put up on Raw Slow Gaming. Um, so I'd love to hear what you think of the game and what you would want in the game and everything like that. Maybe if I'm connecting this properly with some slopes and a workforce, we will have a lot more visitors. Uh, so I won't try that and we will close this one at the moment. The surface cliff there. And while I'm setting this up, uh, remember to smash that like button. And also if you haven't done so yet, uh, remember to hit that subscribe button as well. If you want to follow along on our journey here in uh, well Snowtopia, and uh, I guess uh, well basically follow along on uh, the development on uh, the game. So actually here we will do something a little bit different from what I'm usually doing. I were going to say just straight down there, but uh, I think we will hook it up to there. And uh, then we'll add in a worker there to that village, so to say. And we will take a run off from here. Just connecting it in there. So there we go. Now, do we want... We, of course, we want to are well are going to come down this side as well. I'm just thinking about how, and I think we will try to pretty much ride the ridge here all the way down on that side of the mountain. Um, so we'll see if I'll be able to get that in. We'll work ourselves uh, from the top to the bottom. Of course, which is pretty much what you always do, uh, building a ski run. Right, so. So I want it to follow the ridge. The ridge goes somewhere along there. Flattens out, that is totally fine. Take a little bit of a detour, trying to make this a uh, red run. I really thought that would be, or tried to get that to red, but it still turned black. Um, which is unfortunate. Uh, I think it's a good run though, so we will keep it. I will not bother with uh, fixing that up, so to say. Uh, yeah, I said it's so hard to make the runs you want to, to make in terms of... Uh, well, difficulty.
And now we've got plus four, so beginners uh, plus one as well. That's good. And uh, we lost it just as I said that. It's all right. Um, let's see here. So we'll take our run straight off from there. And um, pretty much where will we run it? I think we'll run it. There's really no point in trying to get it red, especially this one. Something along the lines of that. Uh, we'll take in a little bit of a more adventurous route, so to say, uh, down the mountain like this, well, or in between uh, the rocks. Uh, something I, I know uh, that we have done this pretty much on all the peaks, but uh, I really like to do it that way, and uh, I think. Uh, I think it's a good way to alter, alter the runs or connect the runs, so to say. Uh, I will try to do the same here. A more natural flow, I feel, would be uh, going from left to right here, though. But I think that uh, that actually works out better. Yeah, that definitely works out better and uh, this one already splits and, and these two connects to the middle one so this uh, here in the middle straight down you could definitely say were or is like a main run for this uh, this little mountain here so now then can I connect this to anything else really in a reasonable way no, not really. Not that I can think of at least. Uh, we could try to have a run going down here, uh, but that should, I feel like that uh, would be suitable to like a ski area here that we connect it to that is more gentle, but then I would like to build that first for going off the mountain here uh, with a short slope or something like that. Yeah, uh, probably like a gentle up here somewhere and then connect to this point and uh, then you could have a gentle go around here in uh, the valleys, so to say. And then you have the peaks that you build the runs off. Uh, that's at least pretty much uh, how I have tried to do so far. Uh, so connecting the peaks or having a peaks up high and doing try to do as diverse runs as possible and then taking advantage of the valleys and having well more gentle slopes uh, there and then of course you have like this uh, mountain ridge which we haven't done anything with uh, we did do that over here, uh, just well, just earlier in this episode, uh, with pretty much all of these crazy shenanigans. Uh, well, when we were building this, uh, actually really nice green and blue runs, and connecting to the village here. So this uh, small little village have like, uh, well, it has four lifts, pretty much going in each direc direction uh, not one going north I guess two in uh, going to the west and uh, one to east and one to south and uh, this lift is maybe a little bit unneeded serving the same as uh, as the others ours are uh, so we could probably close this one down and uh, this one also. But I feel like I want some shorter lifts like that. Um, so not much to choose among there. So at least we reached over 100 skiers there. So now we got one more worker we could put in into our lift system or our lifts. I uh, don't know where we could use that or rather we can uh, open one more lift 
that's pretty much it. And I don't really know where I I I, I really don't know where my next move would be actually. Uh, got to think that through a little bit. So I don't really are that fond of this peak. Um, this is a mess. A proper mess. And uh, yeah. This station like super floating and this one totally embedded in the mountain and floating. Uh, so it's, it's all right. That's, uh, that's due to me, I guess, placing down the lifts uh, where I didn't need to do that, but uh, oh well. So let's actually, I think yeah, we'll not cut it short, but I think we'll end it pretty much here. Uh, and I think we'll try to find a good vantage point here for uh, some closing thoughts or something. Uh, and I guess this will be pretty much it from the end of the world here, uh, looking up through our ski system, ski runs, and uh, from here you can see that you have well some really gentle slopes here just up ahead, uh, a little bit to the right following the lift, and uh, yeah you have a pretty scary looking mountain to the left and some scary looking runs, especially when you can see the end of the world so to say, uh, giving it away just a little bit. Uh, of, of it, so to say, and there we saw a beginner swooshing down the mountain, but of course we are running it uh, in super speed, so that's why. But uh, yeah, I think it's a pretty nice look here, at least, so to say, or uh, uh, view. And I hope you have enjoyed and are enjoying the view. And with that said, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time here on the channel. Thank you and bye bye. You have been watching Rollsco Gaming, and I hope you have enjoyed. On clicking on the video on the left, you will see the next video in this series, and on the right, our latest upload to the channel. And with that said, thank you again for watching.